what's up YouTube, in this video we're going to be doing the first ever Minecraft episode for the Inspiration series. And that is when I tour one building per, per video, um, and I and I give you little ideas that, about it and stuff like that. <clears throat> but today guys, we're going to start off with a small suburban house. Um, and it's quite beautiful guys, I absolutely love this house. It has like a front yard, it includes a front yard, like the side yard. And it includes a backyard too, but it's not over here, it's somewhere else. Yeah, it's right there. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry about that. And over here, guys, um, we have a nice little, like, like path using sideways, like, a, a cha-cha. No, not cha-cha, sorry. Um, I just watched it. I just watched Corrales, and that makes me say that sometimes. Um, it, it makes me, as, and, um, Acacia, yeah. It has some stone brick paths on that part of it. It also includes a garage, guys. It, it fits a lot for a small house, so it's going. <clears throat> Excuse me. So as you guys can see, when you enter the house, you have this nice red carpet. You have a nice table with um a potted plant, a um a what do you call it, painting, and a nice design lamp. Um, I'm not gonna mention the names of the flowers, guys, because I may fail badly. Mm -hmm. And and over here, guys, we also have um left on the left hand side, we have a we have like a hanger so you can hang your coats up after you get home from work or whatnot. Or whatnot. We also have somewhere we can put our shoes. Next, guys, we have the, my the only bedroom in the house, which is of course my bedroom. <laughs> um, I know it's quite boring in here, but I think my favorite, yeah, my favorite thing is probably the bed. That's the best thing inside this bedroom. I love this bed. It, I love the design. <laughs> um, it's a very, very, very simple build. An example of a simple build here. Um, so yeah. We also have a, um, a, like, painting. We also have another painting on, on, like, the top of the bed. We also have a nice yellow rug with a modern coffee table. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I, have, and I have about two or three modern coffee tables in here. I believe I have three. Um, and they all include, like, this tablecloth above it. Using gray carpet with black and gloss. Um, and also, guys, <laughs> we have, um, a few pot a few more potted ones with a few more bookcases in there. So yeah, let's leave my lovely room and let's go into the study room. <clears throat> so here's the study room first of all. Um we as you guys can see we have these nice filing cabinets. Um we also have a, a nice little laptop with some more um <clears throat> excuse me, with some more like potted plants. We also have a painting in here. This is probably one one of like the Rooms. I think my room is the second boring room. <laughs> this is not my I yeah, it's kind of my real house in Minecraft. I, I stole a few features from my house to put into here. Even for the exterior, I stole a few um like house ideas I have in real life. Also guys, we have another lamp here, another example of a simple build. And also guys we have our living room here, which is which here are the other two minor coffee tables. We have a um a modern coffee table in front of the sofas, and as you guys can see, we have a lovely fireplace. And the real and the reason why I add a fireplace in my houses, in some of my houses at least, anyways, is because it gives an extra effect. Like it gives, it has a lot of detail to the interior and exterior, depending on if you put a chimney or not. And also, um, it gives you some light to your room or house, whatever. Over here, guys, we have another painting and a modern coffee table. Another one, an orange carpet. Some sofas using nether brick stairs, and we also have an, a painting in there. I don't even know if I just said that. Here's like, this is not supposed to be a screen door. I know it kind of looks like one, in my opinion, like a sliding door, like a sliding glass door. I don't know why I said screen door. But this is just a nice little window to look through. Um, and here, and here, over here, once again, we have little slides. Here's the kitchen, guys. Now it's a teeny weeny weeny teeny weeny weeny teeny weeny kitchen. Of course, I of course I don't know why I need to say the words. Like I don't know why I need to to make a repetition of the words. Um, well, I can fit a lot for this tiny kitchen. I can fit like cabinets. I can fit a microwave. I can fit like a, a nice little painting for detail. I can fit an oven, like an area where you chop your food up, like those chopping boards, whatever. Like if a kitchen island, a fridge, and like another like, little like ceiling boundary, whatever boundary, sorry boundary. 
Um, also, guys, this gives you this kitchen actually gives you access to the um to the like backyard. This is kind of like the backyard, seeing as we're at the back of the house right now. Um, you guys may think that's the back of the house right there, but it's actually not. This is the back of the house. And what I like about, I, what I love about this house is, like, where the ceiling or, like, roof does not meet up. That's what I think is cool. And we also have another pot of plants over here. I love, I love my pot of plants. Um, over here, guys. Hold on, I forgot to tour the bathroom, but I'll do that later on. But over here, guys, we have a nice laundry room, or utility room, whatever. Same as near the entrance of the house where we started the tour, um, we have, we have the, um, like, the little coat hanging thing. We have a nice washer and dryer. It's a, it's a nice, like, machine, I guess, nice machineries. And it also leads, and it also gives you access to the garage, which is, here is the swag mobile. <laughs> Here's the swag mobile. Um, we have a few shelf. We have like a little shelving unit. I say a, I say a few. It's a single one with, with, with like three slots of shelving. I guess I don't know what I'm talking about. Over here we have a nice little like machine. I guess to lift up your car or whatever, what not to chop up things or I don't know. Over here, guys, I use the coal ore because it matches with stone first of all, and second of all, it gives you a nice look of oil stains as if you spilled oil and like it's stained on the floor. Over here we have our Snap-on Toolbox or Matco, depending on which toolbox you guys like. I would always prefer Snap-on. <clears throat> Over here guys is Flammable Liquid. I was gonna put Methylene because I heard that that's on the Breaking Bad show, like Methylene. I never watched Breaking Bad before, but I heard that there's something called Methylene on it. But I just decided to put Flammable Liquid. A little container. And of course, guys, here is the swag mobile. I have a car tutorial on the channel. Um, so check out the, um, Minecraft vehicle tutorial playlist. Now, as I said, I forgot the bathroom. Here's the bathroom. We have a nice little roll of toilet paper. We can have our toilet where we take our imaginary dumps. And oh, I just fell in. Oh my god, I fell into it. I need to wash myself in the sink over here. <laughs> Over here, over here, guys, we have a nice little shower design, and we also have a toilet in here. And there we go, guys. That's that's the mine. That's a mine. That's our Minecraft house for the like. This is our suburban house tour done, completed. The first ever um inspiration series video. So stay tuned, guys, for all of these videos. Um, stay tuned for future upcoming videos. Um. And yeah, hopefully you guys stay tuned for, especially inspiration series, where you can get inspiration for your Minecraft build. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Um, as you guys can see, our house is surrounded by a nice colonial house and a nice, nice like, futuristic modern house or whatever. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you guys all later. Take care.